Sandra Smith and John Connolly, 10 years. Sandra is married to John Connolly and is a straight woman. Their daughter named Cora Bell Connolly and she was born in 2013. Their son is named Connolly Jr. and he was born in 2015. Sandra loves their kids so much that she posts lots of pictures of them on her social media pages. John Connolly talks about business and his family lives in Lincoln Park, Chicago. Sean Hannity and Ainsley Earhart, over a year. They're both reporters for Fox News and were just divorced. Many news outlets, including Vanity Fair, say that Sean Hannity and Ainsley Earhart have been dating in secret for a while now. These facts may not seem important. The two of them have both tried to shut down the reports, but it hasn't worked. It's said that they were dating before their divorces were settled in 2019. Still, for now, both TV hosts are focused on their jobs. Earhart co-hosts Fox & Friends, while Sean runs Hannity. Greg Gutfeld and Elena Musa 18 years. The Russian dresser, model, and fashion designer Elena Musa is well known. She's best known for being married to Greg Gutfeld, a famous Fox News host. Musa was famous before she got married because of all the things she'd done in the fashion and beauty industries. They met for the first time when Gutfeld became editor in chief of Maxim UK in 2004. He was staying in a room next to Musa while going to a meeting with editors from all of Maxim's magazines. After going out together for five months, they got married in New York City in December 2004. Robin Roberts and Amber Lane, 16 years Robin Roberts and Amber Lane have been together for 16 years and they're partners. The TV host and her lady love have been dating since 2005. They met through friends and both became friends. At first, they kept their relationship between themselves, but Robin told everyone about it in 2003. Since Robin and Amber have kept the press out of their personal lives, we're sure that their relationship has grown stronger over the years. They've been together for a while, but there are no plans for them to get married soon. Even though a celebration would be nice, things are doing well without it. Ted Danson and Mary Steenburgen, 27 years From afar, Mary Steenburgen has always liked Ted Danson. She said that watching Cheers on bad days made everything better right away. Well, the American star doesn't have to turn on the TV to do that anymore because the celebrity lives with her husband. Danson says that Steenbergen is a wonderful person and that he's lucky to have her. He was about to give up on life when the woman walked in with new things to make things more interesting. That's how real love works, right? Geraldo Rivera and Erica Michelle Levy, 19 years Geraldo Rivera works as a reporter for Fox News, a lawyer, and a political commentator. He became famous after the mystery of Al Capone's vaults, a live TV special that showed Capone's hidden vaults under Chicago's landmark Lexington Hotel. Rivera was married five times and had four kids with three different women. His wife is Erica Michelle Levy, whom he married in 2003. They met in 2001 when Levy worked as a director on Geraldo's TNT show, Rivera Live. Even though they were 32 years apart in age, they started dating soon after she joined the show. They got married in August 2003 and have a daughter named Solita Liliana Rivera. Chris Harrison and Lauren Zima, two years. The website Screen Rant says that Chris Harrison and Lauren Zima hit it off right away. In 2019, they chose to tell everyone about their romance. It was Harrison's first public romance since his split from Gwen, his ex-wife, and the mother of his two children. We know Harrison is the proud host of the TV shows The Bachelor and The Bachelorette. Zima, on the other hand, works as a reporter for Entertainment Tonight. This is so true that she started a show on ET called Roses and Rosé, where she talks about past Bachelor episodes. They were together during lockdown and are still going strong today. Cynthia Nixon and Christine Marinoni, 16 years well-known actor Cynthia Nixon is best known for her parts as Miranda Hobbs in HBO's famous Sex and the City show. Because of her fame, the actor has been a strong backer of gay rights. She met her wife Christine Marinoni at a gathering for equal rights in 2002, and the two of them got engaged two years later. After that, they've been together, and based on their public outings and social media posts, they look more than happy. Nixon found love again after breaking up with a boyfriend of 14 years, which was very hard for her. We wish her and Marinoni the best. 
Harris Faulkner and Tony Berlin, 20 years. The website Republic World says that Tony Berlin, who's married to Harris Faulkner, met the famous writer at a key point in both of their lives. As a worker in his own right, Tony worked with Harris, who was making waves as a well-known news reporter. Over the years, their relationship grew stronger, and in the end, they made their promise official by getting married. The couples built a life together, despite the challenges of their personal and work lives since they got married. Tony and Harris have been there for each other through the ups and downs of their lives, making a strong relationship that's seen them through hard times and happy times. Gio Benitez and Tommy Daddario, six years. This person, Giovanni Benitez, works for ABC News in the United States. On the network, you can see him on Nightline, Good Morning America, and World News Tonight, among other shows. An interesting fact about Benitez is that he's famous for getting married to Tommy Daddario. The TV host often brags about his husband on social media, and the two seem to be very happy together. They met on Instagram and went on their first date a week later. Soon after, they moved in together. Eight months later, Benitez asked him to marry her while they were on vacation in Paris. The historic Walton House in Miami, Florida was the place that they got married on April 16, 2016. Billy Porter and Adam Smith, 11 years. When you see Billy Porter on the red carpet, you probably first notice how great he looks in his outfit. Then you quickly move your eyes to his husband, Adam Smith, who's almost always with him. Since 2009, when they met, Adam's been a big part of Billy's life, but he's more than just the less famous husband of a famous person. He runs a successful business and co-owns a high-end glasses brand. His story's pretty interesting. Stephanie McMahon and Triple H, 20 years. Stephanie McMahon and Triple H are one of the most famous pairs in the WWE. Stephanie is the daughter of Vince McMahon, the big boss, which you might not know. She started in the boxing business when she was young. Shouldn't be a surprise that she's seeing Triple H, another famous WWE star. Even though their relationship on TV was fake, they quickly fell in love in real life. Finally, after three years, they got married and haven't been apart since. Stephanie and her boyfriend are still working in the field and have high-level jobs in the family business. Matt Damon and Luciana Barroso, 18 years. Matt Damon's fame was shining bright in 2003, and Luciana Barroso found him thanks to it. The skilled actor met his beautiful wife in Miami, Florida, while making one of his most famous movies, Stuck on You. As the saying goes, the rest is history. The actress from Mars has four beautiful children from Luciana. Matt became a better guy as they raised their girls. His and Luciana's private lives are just that, private. They kept most of their relationship secret, which is likely why it worked out so well. Their personal and work lives stayed separate, which is a great skill. Patrick Mahomes and Brittany Matthews, nine years. Patrick Mahomes finally had the right time in 2020 to ask Brittany Matthews to marry him after dating for eight wonderful years. Then, after a happy time of dating over a long distance, they moved in together in a $1.925 million house in Kansas. The couple's been together since 10th grade and is said to be as happy as ever, especially since they found out they were going to have a girl. It looks like Matthews is the best of all the important awards that have been named after the football player. Les Miles and Kathy Miles, 28 years. The website Republic World says that Les Miles met Kathy, who would become his wife when he was an assistant coach for the team at Michigan University. Kathy was on the same team as him, but she was on the women's team. When he became head coach at Oklahoma State for the first time in 1993, they said their vows. They got married and have had four kids since then. Their jobs have also done very well. Miles has been the head coach for Kansas Jayhawks since 2021. He was fired that year, though, and he and the university came to an agreement where he would get about $2 million as payment. If you've watched the video till here, that means you've enjoyed the video. Subscribe! Don't forget to turn on the notifications bell icon 